Right, well now I've been uh, playing with this boost converter to uh, send DC voltage over a long cable, but um, there's another really good use for these things, and that is powering high power LEDs. And that's because this thing's got uh, constant current control on it, uh, so that we can limit the current to the LED. Now, if I remember rightly, um, with the current control turned down to minimum, if I start turning up the voltage on this thing, uh, that's coming on nicely now, and that's limited at 32 volts. And I've got a feeling that's about 25 watts of power going through that LED. So what I want to do is set this thing up for 50 watts, and uh, and then when it gets dark, I can uh, switch it on and off and see how bright the LED is. So what I need to do now is measure the current going to the LED because I don't have a current meter on this uh, boost converter. Right, so I've put the uh, DVM here intercepted into the current path um, of the LED. I'm going to start winding the volts up. Right, so the LED lights up, and again we get to about 30 volts, and we're at 0.9 amps. Now the power supply that came with this LED says 1.6 amps, so I can start turning the current up on this thing now to try and get the 1.6 amps that we're looking for. So I'm looking at here. Okay, that's going up. The LED is getting bright. Right, so that's the um, current control adjusted to put 1.6 amps through the LED. And now if I plug this in, the LED comes on at full 50 watt power. So it's daytime now, it doesn't look very bright. So um, actually, there's one other thing I want to put on this. I'll do that now. Right, to complete the setup, I've put this uh, wireless switch unit on there, and there's the remote control. Now if I press button 5, the LED comes on. So, all I've got to do now is wait until dark, and then see what this looks like. 